What's up, what's up, YouTube? It is that Barbara James, Barber in the Ashburn, Virginia area. So I just finished doing onboarding call for Pi County for the day. So uh, I'll put a little clip in to show you just a little insight of it, nothing too much. Now, if you decide to join, what to start looking, looking forward to as you join. Um, it is Monday, so like I said in the previous video, they do do the, the Money Matter Mondays, so I'll be tuning into that, and I'll go ahead and, and drop a little clip in there as well right now. An agent who's gonna really take the initiative and put you in the right spot. So you have a business to run, if you're a barber, if you want to... After that, today I'm going to uh, start just doing things right, so I got cash, so I've decided now every Monday is when I'm gonna go to the bank, and deposit all my cash that I make throughout the week. And that's pretty much it for today. You know, I'm gonna do some marketing today um, and I'll take you guys along that journey as well. Just what it's like to do some marketing from um, a studio standpoint, uh, since you don't have the backing of like the barbershop and things like that. So just small things. I mean, I, I watched the video, the low hanging fruit video from the um, 245 Academy. So we're just gonna start to put all this stuff into action and we're just documenting this whole process and we're gonna see how it goes. So uh, I'll show you guys what's next. So just finished watching some of the video. I won't be able to sit through the whole video because I just got other things I gotta get done today. Um, but uh, really good stuff so far today was about insurance, um, all types of insurance for your business, even personal insurance like, like uh, auto insurance and things of that nature, which they have, um, if you decide to go through with it, they have another video about um, like life insurance um, that's, that was pre-recorded or or it's in, I think it's in the Academy or Foundations, it's, it's in one of the two. And um, it's with Basio and an agent and uh, they just sit down and talk. And that's a really good video. And he actually gives out his phone number so you can contact him and he'll help you find other agents in your area so i reached out to him right after i watched that video and he gave me a number to an agent um in my area in the herndon virginia area so uh and and that's what i really love about this academy um it's just that it's like it's really just helping you become a better person overall which was just my entire goal for like this year was just to really just just understand many more things about life so i can do better um for my family and things of that nature so like really highly recommend taking the time to uh trying to figure this stuff out yourself if you if you can you know it's definitely always better to have somebody who is a professional in the field to help you so that way you're not wasting too much time and money you know that was my thing so um definitely uh check some stuff out man like you know i know this is like the most well like, i'm at 27 so this stuff to me is just like it's it's super interesting to me now it's just like you know you really just start thinking about i'm starting to really just not now but like i like i definitely thinking of my future in a different perspective so just this stuff is this is just starting to become more interesting to me rather than watching like football games or something like that so highly recommend you know for uh younger people you know just definitely check it out um it's like just take baby steps if you have to but just like definitely try to get your foot in somewhere in there so you can just start leveling uh your life up um in the future because regardless if you're 21 today you're gonna be 27 37 47 it's gonna happen so you know by the grace of god it's gonna happen so you know definitely get yourself prepared for that time i know y'all have heard it a million times but you know a million one never hurt nobody. So uh, right now I'm about to head to the gym and then, um, like I said, deposit my money in the bank and uh, I'll take you guys along with me for that stuff. And then once I get back from doing all that, I'll start working on my marketing. And I'll show you guys uh, things that I picked up from the academy that I'm gonna start applying now. So see you guys then.
What's up YouTube? So I just wanted to show you guys this is another tactic that I use. I have made a couple of shirts that just show my name. I wear them in public and you know, it's an easy tactic and you don't have to do much, you just wear the shirt. So check it out. So let's get started on this marketing. So um, first thing I'm gonna do, cause I actually was doing this before I even uh, started watching the videos was he mentioned Facebook groups. So I'm gonna show you guys now what Facebook groups I'm a part of that you can maybe type into your search to find in your area to help you uh, connect with the people around in your area to uh, start building those relationships. So let's take a look. So one thing to keep in mind when looking up groups to join is to think of interests that you are interested in. So for example, I have gamers of DMZ. I used to be a pretty big gamer, not so much anymore, but that was something I was really interested in, so I joined that group. Um, barbers group and stuff like that, obviously that's not gonna be a place where you're gonna find clientele. That's just a place for me to just reach out with and connect with other barbers. So I definitely wouldn't search for that in terms to look for clientele. Um, but look, another one right here, Virginia Sneaker Exchange. I love my shoes, so that's another place I go to. But, you know, I would mainly be looking for things more along the lines like Center, Center Real Chantilly Community Group. Um, maybe even uh, basketball groups. Uh, Rest and Herney Community Group. Loudoun County Social Collective. And these are just surrounding areas near me all within like you know five to maybe 20 miles i even joined like nova small business exchange i joined those type of groups as well just to get ideas i see some things they post and they give some ideas and stuff like that to check out so these are just small ideas you know things to you can look at yourself um wherever you may be so now what i'm going to do is i'm going to go in so like i said i was doing this before i even started on the uh on the academy so i'm going to show you guys something that i had done which i recommend all you guys to do when doing this is go and create like i have here my social media posts right so when i go here i have it saved in my notes so this helps me be more efficient, right? That's why um, Bill Gates said, he loves hiring lazy people because they find easier ways, more efficient ways to do things. And this is perfect. Go to your notes, create your social media posts. Have that already said. I'm gonna add to this, I haven't touched it up. I think it said since, uh, since May of last year. So now that I'm here, I'm just gonna add a couple of things now that I've gone through some things now that I've learned some things read books uh, joined academies and things like that I'm gonna add some verbiage to this to help and um, this is just a great idea for you guys so you don't have to come in every single time and go on each group and type it up every single time so I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna uh, revise this a little bit and then I'll show you how I take this and put it in the the, uh, the groups. And then after that, I'll give it a few hours or so later tonight, we'll come back and look at what type of um, traffic is bringing in and what type of attention is getting and see what type of feedback I'm getting. So here's my new and improved social media post. So I know I know you're, you're probably gonna see like below our pictures attached to my work and you don't see pictures. I'm gonna show you what I do post when I post on the group that will better explain why I put that in my social media posts. So let's head over to Facebook. All right, we're here now back at Facebook. So let's click our first group that we're gonna post in and let's do Centerville Chantilly Community Group. So they even have, so most groups, some groups are like this because they don't want people spamming. So they create the thread only on this, or you can only post on this thread only. Um, personally, I'm not a big fan of that one because like, 
I just feel like you get, first of all, it's not like, like that. Like it's not like immediately you come in and you see it, right? It's like you now have to go to the comments. And now look, it's like 44 comments, which is like not that much, but for most people, they're not gonna search through 44 comments. And it just makes your posts just get kind of saturated in here. You can always still do it, you know. Um, you can always still do it, just, you know, you never know. Um, you know, uh, I'll still do it because uh, maybe even just the people with the businesses might want to collab with me or something. So I'll definitely still post in here. Um, but I can't do the post that I, I like to do, like the way I like to do it. So let me find one where I can do do it the way I like to do it. So this one allows you to post the way I want to post. And I'll show you how I do that. So what I like to do is you come up, and this is like no for sale post, not familiar with blah, blah, blah. Okay, whatever, no politics ever, yeah, yeah. So there's always definitely guidelines and things of that nature that you wanna be mindful of. So let's go here, write something. So what I'm gonna do, is I'm gonna take my social media post, copy the whole thing, copy. Now I'm gonna go back to Facebook and paste it. And if you want, and look, that pops up too, which is really cool, because that's my booking link, so they can just click that. Oh, I'm not gonna remove it. But they can just click it and go straight to my booking link, which helps. Anything to make things a lot simpler for your people is what will help you the most. Um, so now I'm gonna add to my post and I want to add, why can't I? Hold on, let me figure something out. So usually I'm able to add pictures. Um, for some reason, I'm not finding that to be here. For some reason I can't do it, so. No problem, you know, I got Instagram. Everybody has an Instagram, so they can go check that out. Um, but what I did go ahead and do is I put, uh, you can click right here where the red marker is and click check in. So I did click check in and I put my business there because um, it has my direct address. Uh, if you do want a video on how to be able to add your business to Facebook, let me know. It's not complicated, but it is at the same time. <laughs> um, so this is what I do, man. You know, you go on Facebook, you go on your group, you post, you write your post, booking link is there, address is there, so they can just, like I said, I'm making it very easy and accessible for them so they can find out how much my cuts are, how far it is from where they live, and they get to see the quality of my work, you know, through um, my Instagram. So I'm gonna go ahead and post this, and then I'm gonna just look around to other groups um, to see like if I can add the photos, because I really wanna put that in there, because I really wanna show you guys how I used to use that to, to grab people's attention. Um, I would put pictures of my haircuts just to grab their attention, so that way they can hopefully dig deeper um, in trying to book an appointment. So let me go ahead and post this. Let me double check. Always just triple check your work, guys. Make sure it's all good. James, is that it's a live barber gallery. Looks good. Looks great. So, so yeah. So just go ahead and hit post. Um, sometimes they all have it where the admin has to. Uh, okay, so my my uh, post has been published. Sometimes it'll say like admin has to check your post before it gets published, which is cool. They're just gonna make sure that it's sticking to the guidelines that is in this group, whether it be like no profanity, no whatever. Um, so let me see, let me search around uh, these groups to see where I can add, where I can add a photo on my post. All right, so I found one, um, kind of sucks because I found out what I have to do. I had to remove the uh, booking link um, but if anything, they can always just copy and paste. So it's still pretty easy. Um, so what I would do is, what I like to do to make it simpler on yourself is go to photos, find something that you're, you're proud of, some, some type of work that you're really proud of. You know, I, I like to do like, I like to do one that shows, uh, I like to do one that shows multiple 
hair textures and types and different uh, styles that I've done. So that way I can make sure to show to everybody, you know, like, oh, this dude can not, he can cut all types of hair, you know? Here's one, okay? So what we're gonna do is now, I'm gonna hit recover on that one. Let me find like two more. Oh, that looks super clean. And it's showing a different hair texture. So that's good. Here's another good one. That's clean, shows the beard work, shows the fade, and shows that I can do straight hair. And look, I can create some nice shape and flow to the hair, so that's nice. So I'm gonna recover that guy as well. Pick something like this, just to show the beard work heavy. So let me go ahead and recover that photo as well. Good, perfect. Look at that photo. Phenomenal photo, haircut was great. Um, so let's go ahead and recover that one as well. Do is select the photos you want. Select these. And I'm gonna get this one too because it's a nice professional photo of me so they can see who they're dealing with. They can see they're dealing with a professional. Grab those photos and then what you wanna do, add to album, right? So now you're gonna create new album and you're gonna just type in um, Facebook post. Save it. Now you got all the photos that you want to post on your Facebook post. So now, when you come here, you're gonna hit the green button, because that's your photos. And what you would do is you would hit that, and look, Facebook post. Hit Facebook post, and now look how simple that is. Boom, that's it. And look how that looks, man. That looks so professional. You know, that looks so clean. Look at that. That's phenomenal, man. That looks really good. So, these are just things you can do. Like I said, go find those groups first that you can join and then just uh, rinse and repeat. So this is a beginning foundation of how to try to get, you know, clean, crisp photos, you know, just put your work out there, man. You know, like Chris Basio said, like you go to Walmart, you, you look around. There's a reason why Sports Clips is 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 taking is really you know has its its foot in the game because like people, I know we really want our work to really speak, and, I, and I'm not telling you don't to slack on your cuts. You know, definitely try to find stuff that you know definitely put stuff out there that is really good in quality. But you know, I know like in the beginning. If you're new, you might be a little nervous, you might be timid, you might say, you know, I'm not that good, I don't want to embarrass myself, I don't want to put myself out there. I'm, you know, that's not all that it takes to be a successful barber, okay? That's not all that it takes. You know, I've been uh, working hard on this craft for, um, like, only, it's, it's been two years, but I've been working hard, man. I'm, like... I've done a lot of a lot of things, a lot of haircuts, a whole lot of haircuts, a lot of like promotionals. When I was in the, starting in my first stage, I was doing a lot of promotionals. I was, you know, I was like my brother and and a friend of mine. I would just give him free hair. My brother-in-law, I would give him free haircuts just to allow me to cut, cut, cut. So, but you know, whatever work I had at the time, I was just putting out there, and. Um, some people still from that day are still my clients to this day, um, you know, but and, and I say that because uh, I know in the beginning we tend to focus so much on the cuts and, and that's great. That's what we're doing. We're hair. We're cutters. We're hair cutters, you know, um, but just don't forget to to also just establish that relationship with them. Just talk to people, man. It's not like you have to think of like freaking Einstein questions, you know, what's the square root of pi type stuff. Just ask them like. You know, if you guys want me to make a video on questions to ask people, if you're introverted, if you find it hard to talk, you know, let me know in the comments below and I'll make a video of just prompts of questions that you can just ask your clients, you know, make sure to listen because there's things they'll say that you can easily piggyback off of, you know, say, how was your day? Oh, this is cool. Nothing just went here, here and there. Oh, okay. Well, where'd you go? Why did you, what'd you do when you went there? Oh, you know, I went there to just check out blah, 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 and da, 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 da. Uh, okay, that's cool. That's what's up, man. Like, how'd you find out about, you know, it's just like, it's just a rabbit hole. And you just keep taking what they say and finding questions within what they say. All right, so um, 
We'll bet we'll check back in. I'm gonna go through and, and, and post on all my groups. Um, and we'll check back in. If you buy a condo from the mid 400s, like like this, y'all. This be the conversation I'll be having with my wife. This this is. You got a, if you got one like that, man. Y'all better put a ring on it quick. Um, so we'll check back in uh, around, like I said, like 8, 9 p.m. Maybe we'll do just 8.30, meet in the middle. And, and we'll check, we'll see what they say. All right, let's see. All right, so I just wanna show you guys, I just finished posting in all the groups and look at that. I've already got people interacting with the post. So let's take a look and see what is going on. Somebody comes on the post, let's see what it looks. Love, hearts. Comments, let's see what they say. James does great work. Yeah, I cut her son. James is truly amazing talented. So I got people vouching for me because I already cut some of these people. Saving your info for my teenage son. He's looking for a great barber. Look at that. Already getting. Congratulations, your work looks neat. I mean, that's cool, thank you. You know, um, but already getting. Look at all the interactions I'm already getting and I just posted this. So this is an extreme hack, man, to really start building that clientele for you. And like I said, we're just gonna look at that already. That's actually, this is uh, something that I will, I offer to somebody because I did create my own website and this person was looking for help to redesign theirs. So if you have a nice little skill set, I go ahead and do that and, and I'm finding all this from in the, the groups. So this is a nice little side hustle you can do, you know? But look at all this love already, man. So. Just go ahead and put yourselves out there, guys. You never know who's out there looking. Definitely prepare yourself for some people. You know, they're not always the nicest people and whatever. Um, but that's just to come, right? Life isn't perfect. So, so yeah, just, you know, put yourself out there. Hopefully, you can get some love and, and, and get a few clients off of it, you know. And, and one turns to two and two to four. And we just keep going like that. All right. So, we'll check back in at, like, 8.30. Look at that. As soon as I'm about to turn on recording, record, we got another booking. So, let me see it. Oh, it's 8.33. I already got another booking. I had gotten um, another one as well. That guy, the, oh, the, uh, the Nelson guy, he's a returning client, so. But I did get two new bookings since I posted. But let's go take a look online and just see what we what's going on. So let's see, you got nine plus. Let's take a look. This is just from today, man. Like it's, the post is gonna sit up there for a few days, you know. So just imagine in a couple of days what type of action we'll see. So let's take a look. So let's scroll all the way to the bottom so that way we can see start from so you can see okay cool so this is from where we left off at so let's take a look so got some likes here got a comment let's see what she said she said highly recommend i cut her son so like you said like i said like i've been doing this for a while so like look at that 13 likes 13 people that i just reached out to so i'm gonna go ahead and i always make sure to respond back to the people just tell them thank you because they really didn't have to go in and say that but they do so you know get it personal with it say thank you and let's just keep looking got a like got a comment definitely need a new barber you got some skills so i mean it's cool you know like trying to haircuts whatever getting those type of comments it's nice and everything i love it um but you know i'm really here trying to uh some relationships with people so like i said this is just to get them to look like posting these pictures of the like, haircuts like you know locking them in it's like when they come in and you actually had created that relationship with them so i'll go back and respond to these messages a little later i just want to keep going through and showing you guys what the power of a uh, facebook group can do for you and and um and yeah let's see what we got i got another comment James is my best, James is the best. I got her son as well. Spotlight, absolutely, I'll be right. I don't know what that means, but uh, hopefully something good. Um, 
Let's see, likes, 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 so like, 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 dude, like, guys, like, everybody, you just see the type of, which, come check you out, do you have an appointment, right? This is the type of response you can get simply in your groups, and imagine, you know, all these people have friends of friends of friends, so if you get one, you can get more, you know, so this is just awesome, that's awesome, what else we got? Jonathan Fisher, tag somebody. There you go, that's possible client. What'd she say? Very cool, thank you for sharing. She's the admin of the group, so. So that's what it's like, y'all. This is just a very inexpensive, very easy way to just market yourself. And, and this is the type of feedback you can get in just a matter of four hours, you know? And I just sat at home, you know? Super easy, super easy. So go ahead and like the video if you guys like this stuff. Um, just comment down below, um, you know where y'all are at and uh, and how it's gonna and how it's working out for you. Let me know, you know, uh, if this stuff is starting to work for you. All right, y'all. Peace out. So that is the power of posting on Facebook. So if you guys can imagine, not only blocking the clients but doing this maybe once every. So often, every maybe once a month, a month, at once every other month type thing, like the build up clientele quick. Man. So, like for, like I said, I'm documenting this journey. So we're gonna really put this this 245 to, uh, to use and see how it goes. But so far, no complaints, man. So, all right, I'll see you guys in the next video. Pew.